So the goal of the Human Movement and Balance Laboratory is fall and musculoskeletal injury prevention in healthy and clinical young and older adults. We are equipped with a Vicon motion capture system. It is a 14 camera system that works by showing a pulse of infrared light, which bounces off tiny reflective markers that we instrument all over our patient. Um, those markers will then go back into the camera system and we can recreate then in 3D space a computer model of our person. And then we can calculate all the 3D biomechanics, the kinematics and the kinetics, basically how someone is moving. What's the angle of their elbow or the angle of their knee while they walk? What are the forces that are inside the joints in their body as they're walking and going through different perturbations? And then we can use that to, to help better understand how injuries occur and how to prevent them. So we look at any population that may be prone to injure themselves. So people that have issues with low vision, vestibular disorders, neurological disorders. We look at injuries in the workplace that occur or people that get injuries while they stand all day on their feet and they experience um, injuries and joint pain and muscle pain and how we can alleviate those problems, whether it's with different flooring interventions or with different footwear or understanding how those injuries may occur. At Pitt, we try to stay on the front edge of that and we're constantly evolving our classes and our, our techniques and our research so that we can give our students that cutting edge feel of bioengineering of what it really is. Doing graduate level research as an undergraduate is is interesting for sure and it's it's rewarding because I think it's a uh, it's good practice for anything that you want to do in the future for sure. Um, I know that after working in this lab I want to work in this field. Um, I, I'm very passionate about working in this field but working in movement and gait and balance that hands-on experience is really useful and I like it a lot. I think in general that a research experience gives students not only a technical toolkit that they can use but it also gives them experiences that they wouldn't get in the classroom. So they get to collaborate with clinicians at UPMC, they get to collaborate with different companies that we work with as well, and they build those relationship skills um, that they wouldn't get in the classroom. It's a really awesome opportunity, especially at Pitt, there's so many different types of research you can do, and it's really cool to learn in a non-classroom setting. It's also helped me with a lot of my classes um, because I have experience doing things that other students don't. The University of Pittsburgh's engineering program is, is a very challenging environment that gives you what you need to succeed. But to do that, you have to put in the work as well. Um, and bioengineering especially um, is a field where you're involved with helping people, directly impacting people's lives and improving their quality of life as well.